guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am back with another Taylor Swift album inspired makeup look and today I am doing the Reputation album which is the next one after 1989. I'm pretty sure she was just like super duper angry, not too sure why. I can't remember when it came out but it's been a while. Um, I am not in my Reputation era. I'm straight vibing. I'm more or less in my folklore um, era, just kind of chilling and vibing, just nice and soothing. So we all get to those albums when we get to them. But I am doing the Reputation one. A lot of good songs on this album. Now I'm not sure if this is the one that she actually owns. So I don't know if she's doing a Taylor's version of this one or not because I'm pretty sure she owns this one. I will double check that and then let you know at the end. But I think that this will be a super fun look because it's just going to be a nice black and white, maybe just black look. We'll see. Maybe just like a nice smoky eye. But again, I'm straight vibing. I don't know what I'm doing today. I've got a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of inspo. So that's super duper fun. Anyways, I'm starting to ramble now. So what I will do is I will get into this. So let's just begin. To start off this makeup look, what I'm going to be doing is I'll be going in with my Huda Beauty Wild Obsessions palette, the Python one, the nice green one. And I will be using this, I'm thinking this really nice like lightish brown, which is that one there, that's the one that we want, just as our base brow colour. Now that that is looking actually kind of cute, I'm gonna, <laughs> might as well ruin it, but I'm gonna go in with the Wild Obsessions Jaguar palette, which is super cute and super adorable. And I will be going in with this nice deep brown color right there, just to blend in and deepen up my crease. Now keeping with the Jaguar palette, I will be going in and using the black from this one because it is the darkest that I have out of all of my palettes. So I'll be doing that one and just blending it in onto my eyelid and blending it into my crease.
Alrighty, so to go underneath my eye. Uh, eyeballs. I'm going in with my Norvina Volume Number no. Six palette. Yes, the nice space one. Um, I just realized that the black in this one is like more of like a grey toned rather than actual black. So I'll be going with the E5, which is the black, but it's more like a grey tone. And I might light it up with like a white or more of a beige if I need to. Alrighty, so what I'm going to be doing now is I'm actually going to be going in with a like a nice refined glitter um, rather than more of a metallic kind of uh, mix. Um, I'm just trying to figure out which one I want to use first. So there's quite a few options. I may have to go back in with the Jaguar palette. Um, but just having a look at all of my palettes, I'm thinking that the Huda Beauty Empowered palette has a nice one called Bold Moves, which is that one there. But I think I want more of like a grey. So the Jaguar has a couple. So it's got that one and that one that I could mix together. Or Norvina Volume 6 has A3 and mix it with A2. Um, so... I might just see how that one goes, but that's just going to be like a nice sort of uh, just on my lid, but maybe like blend it out with the black. Okay, so it was like a mix of like all of them. So far this one looks a lot more glam than this one, but that's okay. I'm gonna go and do some liner and lashes. Now with my liner, I'm gonna do a nice wing, maybe follow that up. But I might add like a little bit of like, a, I don't know how to put this, but like I'm gonna use my white eyeliner, okay? Just my uh, Made by Mitchell one. Um, I don't know what it's, you know, just the, Thing that goes like around I don't know like a little tail that goes around like a snake I don't know probably something like that so that's what I'm gonna do and I shall be right back alrighty so I did decide not to do the little swellies around my eyeliner instead I just kind of lined it with white which makes it a nice pop um, which is cute as hell 
So, I'm going to finish off this makeup look with some lipstick. I will be going in with my Huda Beauty Liquid Matte Lipsticks in the shade Drama Mama and Miss America. A little bit of an ombre. ombre. Wouldn't really say that. I'd say more like a touch of red with a darker colour around it. there you guys go that concludes my reputation makeup look I think it looks very chic very glam it's a nice like smoky eye with like a nice pop of white just going on I'm very happy with how this one has actually turned out it's very like I don't know I don't know the word but um, I also did look it up uh, she does not own the rights to reputation which means that we get a Taylor's version and maybe some songs from the vault because I am so ready okay all of those songs on reputation are amazing um, I love them they're very like hardcore pop rather than the nice soft pop country pop that she's done in the past which is super fine but like this one just vibes like angry girl energy and yes it is the album that I blast when I'm feeling like crap and I want to just like you know blast out angry girl music without being like super death metal so this is essentially my death metal uh, music that I listen to it's you know nice and hardcore but not super hardcore that I go deaf <laughs> anyway this look is really really cute I'm very happy with how it's turned out uh, if you enjoyed today's video give it a big thumbs up and if you haven't already click that subscribe button down below because I make new videos every Monday and Monday and I will see you guys next week bye